Hey guys, welcome back. It's Save the Gate. We're picking up on Pokemon. Pretty much where we left off, I did. I think I got Dratini like two levels off camera. I also uh, taught in Thunder Wave. Which we had in our TM case that I just forgot about. And he also learned Dragon Rage. So he might be able to do some fights on his own now. He's a lot stronger, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Twister. Mm -hmm. So Dragon Rage is still stronger. Ooh, Sonic Boom sucks. Let's go, that's what I'm talking about. Oh nice, he's getting a lot of experience from that. Alright. So how are you guys liking this series, guys? I'm having so much fun playing this game, like... It's... Like a blast from the past, for sure. Like I said, a lot of it I don't even remember, so it's almost like I'm playing the game for the first time again, which is awesome. I love stuff like that, where... You get a game that you haven't played for a long time, and then you hop into it, and it's pretty much like you played it for the first time. And there's small parts like the beginning of the game obviously I remembered that but like this part like I said I don't even remember this this hideout like if it might not even have been in the original I mean I'm sure it was but I don't remember it at all and let me know in the comments what are games that you guys can just play over and over and over and it feels like if you're playing for the first time like I don't like every Final Fantasy game for me like 7, 10, 8, uh, 9 I can play those games over and over and every time I play it I feel like I do it a different way every time and that's one of the cool things about Pokemon games is there's 150 of them in the first game and there's so many different combinations that you can play the game with like every time you play it it's like you're you're playing a new game Ooh, we got paralyzed. Not cool. Oh, paralyzed and confused. Oh, okay. So he battled confusion and won. Only to succumb to paralysis. That's what I'm talking about. All right. Dang, dude! How many abilities does this guy have? I feel like if I don't heal him, he's gonna die. <laughs> And this is so much experience that he's gonna end up getting from this that I just I don't want him to die. Oh, that's awesome! He's got a shed skin ability. So it, does it get rid of all status effects after a couple turns, or is it just paralysis? Don't it just? Oh, he got straight fucked in the face. All right, come on, you little snake with. Fucking wings for ears. <laughs> Stop hitting me. No! Dang. We should just swap them out. He almost had him though. I think I have a revive actually. Maybe I'll use a revive on him. The grind is real on this one. I was gonna do a little bit of grinding off camera, but I figure I might as well just keep it in. Do I not have a revive? There it is. Three. Three revives. So he should still get experience from that. Get out of here with this paralysis BS though. This magneton's like OP. Alright, let's go. Oh, I thought he was going to get more than that. You hammered me. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Do get out of here, you scrub. Yes, scrubby do. Alright, super potion up our Dratini. And let's get out of here. There was nothing. Oh, is this a warp pad? Oh, I thought it warped it. Oh, oh well, that's cool. I heard a kid was wandering around. 
Where is he? Tell me where you found him. Like, a lot of these guys, they sound like pedophiles for sure. It's like, I heard this kid. I heard he was running around upstairs. I was just trying to find him, you know, to, to bring him to safety. <laughs> Definitely wasn't going to rape him. Oh, straight up one shot. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, man. I'm just not catching breaks. Love about this Jatini at all. I mean, once he levels up, though, to a Dragoneer, he should be strong. Yeah, get out of here with that glare. You ain't gonna hit me. He flew up high. Glare. Missed again. And then he got sucked in the face by a flying bird with his celery stick. Oh, nice. Dude, Chiding is a B. I'm telling you guys. You guys that were hating on Chiding in the beginning. It has been confirmed. He gets some more experience than everybody else. I don't know why. For real, if anybody knows why he gets more experience than the rest of my Pokemon, feel free to let me know in the comments. I mean, I could Google search it, but I'm lazy, so. It, was, it took me enough effort to Google search how to get Lapras. And, uh... How to get to Saffron City. I don't know if I have it in me to type the extra, like, 50 keys. Alright. Silph Scope. Let's go. This guy's got Pokemon, right? We study Pokeball technology on this floor. I don't understand. Why are the scientists, like, trying to Pokemon battle me? Man, my eyes just got really heavy. Sign up Magneton. Let's go. This will probably be the last recording in today's session. Just because I'm feeling a little tired right now. Oh, why am I trying to fight this guy? I'm not going to be able to beat him. Dratini, though. Maybe I can. Maybe, maybe I can beat him. Oh, crap. Wait. Alright, that just paralyzed him. No, stop! Shed your skin, bro! I thought that was your ability. Why are you being a scrub? Don't let me down, I had to spend a lot of money on your bitch ass. No, stop! Oh my god, these guys are like... Beasts. There we go, so we're not paralyzed anymore, which is cool. Not very effective, but it did a crap. No! And then we got re-paralyzed, and we're still confused. Oh my god. Alright, that should kill him. The level up here. Man, we need to level this dude into a dragon in real quick. Coughing. No, we'll keep him out. Keep him out just to bring out the next. Alright, let's get a uh, look at hot dog out there. It's his time to shine. He needs to catch up with the squad. Intimidate Sludge. Do -do 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 -do. Take down, sucker. See you later. Ooh, Arcanine almost got him one hit. I thought for sure it was going to kill him one hit, though, even without a critical. Wow, even with paralysis, Arcanine's faster than coughing. That's funny. Yeah, we gotta get that Dratini back out there for that fake experience. The weenie. Weezen. He looks like he's just straight up herpes. Uh, hmm, 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 hmm. Go herpes. Weezing's attack. Smog. No. Not smog. Critical hit. It did four damage. That was a strong ability, Weezing. But like, if I let Dratini stay out there, he would have got manhandled by that. Sludge. Man, this trainer is like diversifying his Pokemon the moves for sure. He knows how to Pokemon battle. 
Uh oh, hot dog is getting wrecked. Do we need to get any experience? Yes. Put the weenie out, and then I guess we'll go with Blastoise. Blastoise is noise. I mean, we can take this Magnemite though, right? I mean, we don't need to get out for another guy. Oh yeah, we got him. Oh, please go first. Alright, cool. <laughs> I was gonna say, if we don't go first, he dies and we're really like scrubs. It's almost 25. Like a beast. We're gonna have to use some potions on this dude. Alright, let's go. Um, what floor are we on right now? I don't know. I like these warp pads. I don't know if I should be stepping on them or if I should just let them go for now. Dude's got a hit. No. Like, that's a lot of experience that he can get by himself. But, unfortunately, I don't think he can beat a level 33 hit. No. Headbutt. Get out of here. Like, if I was Blastoise and I seen someone trying to headbutt me, I would just turn around and you just crack your head on my back. <laughs> like, poison gas. I don't even remember ever seeing poison gas before. Oh, just poisons. That's stupid. How does Hypno learn a poison type? Hypno's attack rose, but it doesn't matter because he's gonna get wrecked. Water pulse. See you later, sucker. The weenie got to level 25. We really need him to get to level 20 or no, 32. I think 32 is when he evolves. Once we can get that, uh, actually we're gonna use a antidote. On our Blastoise. His goofy looking face. He's like, I got him, coach. I got him. Alright, so we can't do this one yet. A child intruder? That must be you. No, dude, it's not me. I'm not intruding. Um, no, sorry, I am not intruding. I'm, I'm with you guys, you know. Don't be attacking me. I'm with you guys. I'm Team Rocket. That's for sure. That's what I'd be saying if I was our character here. I'd just be like, no, you know, I'm, I'm Team Rocket. Like, actually, I'm your boss. I out, I outrank you because Team Rocket's relatively stupid, so you could just easily trick them. <laughs> no, dude, uh, I'm actually your boss's boss, so that makes me uh, your dad. So uh, give me twenty bucks and your Pokemon. No, get out of here. I didn't do a lot, but I feel like he's gonna kill me if I keep him out. Get our buddy Blastoise back. Ooh, Blastoise should level up from this too. Dude, Blastoise, why are you getting poisoned so much, dude? We're just gonna let you die this time, I guess. Where does Blastoise's water come from too? Like, he has like an infinite amount of water stored in his back, I guess. I mean, that's the only thing I can think of. Which is pretty cool, I guess. Fine, I lost. Yeah, that's, that's what happened. No, it needs a key card. Go home before my boss gets ticked off. Dude, I already wrecked your boss. I mean, I am your boss, dude. Didn't I tell you already? I got a promotion. Because I'm Team Rocket member. We have four rare candies. I really wanted to just use them. I mean, I feel like if we used them, Dratini would just be a straight beast. Alright, let's hit this one now. Alright, so 
We're making some progress. But guys, we're going to call this one for today. If you enjoyed the video, remember to drop a like. And if you want more content, guys, remember to subscribe. I'll throw an annotation on the left side of the screen like I always do. And until next time, guys, keep it real.